Inspired by the military's aircraft drones, the U.S. Navy is aggressively pursuing self-driven undersea vehicles. We, we do see these uh, autonomous undersea vehicles as game changers. They can increase the, the access and uh, increase the range of our manned operational forces, and they can keep man out of harm's way. The undersea vehicles are currently being used to detect mines and map the ocean floor. One recently navigated its way from Cape Cod to Newport, Rhode Island, Officials at the sailboat dotted waters provided a realistic environment for engineers to test the gadgets. And these systems have a lot of computing power in them. They have got very advanced sensors in them, and they have autonomy that can perceive and uh, identify and avoid obstacles uh, and course their own path uh, through obstacles and get to their objectives. With tweaks over the next several years, the military says the drones will be applied more to intelligence gathering. Eventually, the Navy hopes the unmanned crafts will pilot themselves across oceans. Uh, we want these devices to be able to go in and find their way in tough environments through adversarial uh, conditions um, without the aid of operators or the help from operation forces. Compared with aerial drones, the undersea vehicles can be more challenging to control from a distance. That's because the water distorts the transmission of signals. And the drones have to contend with boat traffic, swirling currents, and obstacles on the ocean floor. The UUVs are very communication-challenged uh, devices, so there are very limited uh, capabilities in communications. Um, acoustically, we can communicate with these vehicles, but that's limited bandwidth. Uh, above water, um, we want to pick and choose when UUVs pop up to the surface so that they can communicate uh, over air or satellite. The Navy sees the drones as a cost-effective way to extend the reach of its submarine fleet, which has been gradually shrinking in size since the end of the Cold War. Matt Friedman, Associated Press.